With the CRM and All Pro Web Tools, you can create sign up boxes to place on your website to collect information from visitors. These sign up boxes will automatically generate a record in your CRM for that person. In order to use the sign up boxes, you will need the CRM Web Tool, which you can add by going to Settings and Web Tools. Then go to the Available Web Tools button and scroll down until you find CRM and click Add. And now you have the CRM tool installed. To create a new sign up box, go to Contacts on the left menu and then click on Sign up boxes. This page will show a list of any existing sign up boxes for you to go and edit. You can also create a new sign up box by clicking the Create New Box button. First, you will need to name your sign up box. This is a name that only you will see and can be used to reference later. This next option, Campaign, can be used to automatically put users into a campaign when they fill out the sign up box. If I click on the drop down, I will see a list of my existing campaigns and can select a specific campaign so that when users finish filling out this box, they will then receive the specific list of emails that I created earlier. This next option, Tag, is used to tag your customers after they fill out the sign up box. If I click on the drop down, I will see a list of my existing tags and can select a specific tag that I would like these contacts to be marked as when they fill out the sign up box and are automatically entered into my CRM. This next option, Box Design, is used to add style to your sign up boxes. To create a new design for your sign up box, you will need to use this plus button and will be talked about in another video. This next option, Box Location, is used to describe where you are going to put the sign up box when you are finished creating it. If you want to place your sign up box on your All Pro Web Tool site, you can leave it selected to your site. If instead you want to place it on a website you have hosted somewhere else, for example a WordPress site, you will want to select External Site. This next option, Thank You Page, chooses the page your customers are sent to after filling out the sign up box. If you click on the drop down, you will see a list of all the web pages in your All Pro Web Tools website. The Thank You page must be a page from your All Pro Web Tools website. If you would like your customers to go to a thank you page on a website you have hosted someplace else, you will still have to choose a web page from your All Pro Web Tools website. But then you can go edit that web page and change it to redirect to the page you would like your customers to go to. Next option, Box Width, chooses how wide the sign up box is going to be. If you click on the drop down, you will notice it's measured in pixels. All you need to know is that the bigger the number, the wider the box will be. This next option, Button Value, changes the text in the button your customers will click on when they are finished filling out the sign-up box. To completely finish your sign-up box, you need to select what inputs you want your customers to fill out. These inputs are the same fields used in your CRM records. Whatever inputs you have selected, your customers will be required to fill out, and then that information will be automatically put into a CRM record for them. We recommend selecting as few inputs as possible since most customers are more likely to fill out a sign-up box if it's asking for less information. If you have the CRM Pro web tool, you can also ask for custom inputs in these sign-up boxes. Just like the standard inputs, whatever your customers fill in for the custom inputs will be automatically put into their CRM record if you have the CRM Pro web tool. Lastly, if we scroll down, this text box can be used to create custom text that will be displayed in the sign-up box. When you are finished creating your sign-up box, click Save. Since I selected for the sign-up box to display it on my All Pro Web Tools site, it's going to give me a widget code that I simply have to copy and paste into whatever web page I want to display my sign-up box on. If instead I had chosen for the sign-up box to be displayed on an external site, this page would be showing me a code snippet that I would simply have to copy and paste into the code of my website. 